everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel, my name is Alice and this channel is called Alice's Life. In today's video I'm going to be doing a quick try on haul. I went to a Next Outlet store at a shopping centre last week and I purchased a lot of dresses. I wasn't able to try them on because there's no changing room, which really irritates me because it's not coronavirus anymore, they just did not have a changing room. So I had to buy the items and I'm going to return some of these, but I'm just doing a quick try on haul and you can let me know what you think of them in the comments below. First of all, we've got this dress from the Lipsy brand, but it was in Next. It doesn't actually have a price on it, but I think it might be about £60 usually because Lipsy stuff tends to be fairly expensive, but it was reduced down to £9. I really like it. It's a size 6, but then because it's a wrap dress, it does fit really well. I feel like this string is a bit excessive. Um, I like that it's black because I don't actually have a lot of black clothes and I like the pattern, it's quite a bold print. I tend to go to more towards sort of ditzy prints or like you know small flowers or um, stripes. So this is quite a grown up print but then I kind of feel like when am I ever going to wear a dress like this? And the only, because it would be too smart or too dressy to wear in a office. But then I think for a date or something, like if I was ever going out in the evenings, which we don't actually tend to do that much, but if I did have an occasion, then this dress would really come in handy. So I think I am going to keep this and not return it. I just think it would be a good thing to shove under my bed and bring out an iron whenever I need a dress that's dressy like this. Next we have this black floor dress. I really like this pattern. It's a bit more on the ditzy side. I don't know if it's like thistly print. Um, I like that it's not tight. It's like a little bit sort of scrunched in around the waist but it's quite like flowy it's not clingy to your body and I like the leg slip because otherwise it might be difficult to walk this is one of the longer dresses I've ever tried I think well I suppose like I don't usually wear midi length yeah but I, I really like this material for some reason it feels like good quality so this was originally £30 and it's down to £6 which is really good saving it's in the petite section but I'm uh, five foot six, and you can see how long it is on me the main issue with it, and the reason that I think I'm not going to keep it, is the buttons at the back of the neck. I think I'm just not really a tight neck, turtleneck sort of person. So I think I'm just going to return it, because I can see myself wearing this a couple of times and feeling hyperly overdressed. But then, I think the buttons just going to irritate me, and even when I was trying it on, I was like... <laughs> then we've got this brown dress from Next, and it was originally £28, and it's down to £6 which is another great saving. I really like this dress. I think it's a really good length um, for in the office and I like that it's brown because I don't have a lot of brown clothes. I just think these sleeves are too excessive and they would seriously irritate me. It would make wearing a cardigan or jacket way more uncomfortable. I don't know, it's just so much material. Yeah, so I think I would wear this but I don't think I would really, it wouldn't really become a favourite. So although it is inexpensive, if you're only going to wear something once or twice or a few times, it's not really that much of a great thing, like cost per wear, if you're thinking that sort of way. The fourth item I am definitely keeping, I really like it. I have been eyeing up denim dresses for quite a few years now, and I feel like this is a really good sort. So this is size 8, and it was originally €44, Euros. I don't know why, because I'm in the UK, but then it's down to £19. I like the length is below the knee, so I feel like it would be smart enough for the office. I wouldn't wear it kind of like to a smart conference or if I had a smart meeting, but I think definitely for the office it's good because you're able to cinch in the waist with this adjustable belt and it is below the knee. Also it's long sleeved, but then in summer or autumn or spring I suppose I could roll up the sleeves and it would still look pretty cool. And I can definitely see myself wearing this day to day. Uh, going out and about as well as for work so then it's going to be a really versatile thing my main issue is quite heavy which you would expect from a denim dress and I'm slightly worried that my clothes rail is going to collapse if I keep putting more clothes on it so I don't know but I'm definitely going to keep this poppers are a bit weird but no I think it's good because buttons are more likely to break aren't they yeah so anyway I'm really pleased with this dress and I'm definitely keeping it then I've got another shirt dress so this is from the Lipsy brand uh, there's no original price on it but it was reduced down to £26 um, it's quite a smart dress but I suppose because it's like shirt material it's more likely to get wrinkled than the other one uh, I like the tie waist so you tie it in a bow or something at the side and then the roll up sleeves make it very casual 
but I think it's not as smart and also the material is a lot thinner so I think you'd be able to see your I suppose like pants line and stuff through it so I'm going to return this dress but I do like it but I just wanted to get it to compare between the two sort of shirt dresses because I definitely wanted to get a shirt dress to add that to my wardrobe yes yeah, so I'm going to return this one okay so that's all for this video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up I've got another couple of haul videos coming up for you so if you like that sort of thing subscribe and bye